why you should go for a run when you're in any new city, whether you're visiting as a tourist or uh, you've just arrived, whatever. Go for a run or jump on a bicycle. Arnold Schwarzenegger told me when I met him in, at his home a couple months ago that he, whenever he goes to a new city, he rides a bicycle. Me, I like to run. Either or. That's Tower Bridge in London. And I'm just, uh, the reason why it's good rather than just a walk, I mean a walk is good, but obviously if you run or you cycle, put these off actually, you can, you can cover more ground, you can see more things. Whereas if you walk, maybe you only cover a short, short distance. But running like this, I've just started running from Waterloo Bridge in London. Here we go, here's a wedding going on, or some photography. Um, when you run or when you ride a bicycle, obviously you can carry, you can cover a ton more ground, see more things, plus you get to release those endorphins from exercise. Whenever you exercise, your body releases endorphins and makes you feel good. So when I get home or back to my hotel at the Strand in uh, probably 25 minutes from now, you know what, let's just go this way. I was going to go up Tower Bridge, but let's, uh, let's see this. This is cool. Here's the thing, right? I didn't know I was going to come here. I was thinking I'll just run over Tower Bridge, but now I see something interesting. Because I'm running, I can take a detour. So studies have shown that uh, exercising, obviously, it makes you it makes you feel good. Um, it gives you, but it makes gives you better clarity, more focus. It makes you think, makes you happier, calmer. And if you're happier and you're calmer, that means you have better relationships. And when you have better relationships, you become happier. And when you're happier, you make more money. And when you make more money, you become happier. So it's all kind of intertwined. Let's go for a, let's go down here. See what's down this way, shall we? You can imagine what England must have been like 200 years ago around this area. So here's another view of Tower Bridge. There we go. Looking at it from the other angle. Pretty nice, huh? And then you've got up towards the financial district of London that way. Let's have a look at the Thames. Tides out a little bit. There we go. So let's start to run back now. I've been running, oh, let's see, 23 minutes um, so far. So if I turn around now, should get back in 45, 46, maybe 50 if I stop a little bit on the way just to take some photos or take a snapchat if you follow me on snapchat or if you don't follow me on snapchat just follow me at James Swanick so this is the way I love to see any city you get out you do it in the daytime you get vitamin D this is where we're gonna go right now you get vitamin D you release endorphins you see the sights you feel good you're out, out amongst people What's the downside? Get fit while you're doing it. So many people go on like overseas trips and they just walk. Now that's fine, walking is a lot. Like you can travel, you can cover a lot of distance walking. I'm not saying don't walk, but I'm saying try to do it, you know, every day or every other day. Make sure you get some physical exertion in like a run. Kill two birds with one stone. The other thing is you can see that I'm wearing my earbuds at the moment. Um, before I stop to take this video, I was listening to an audio, uh, an audio book about uh, lifestyle design, living and working overseas, traveling the world, getting paid to do what you love. So you can actually kill three birds with one stone. You can, you can uh, see the sights of London or whatever city you're in. And we're about to go up here. You can get sunlight. Actually, it's four, four birds with one stone. You get sunlight, vitamin D, vitamin D. Let's be shown to alleviate your mood, make you happier, make you feel happier and healthier. How many is that? What have I covered? I've lost my chain of thought. You get sunlight, you get exercise, you get to see the sights, see a new environment. More studies have shown that humans love novelty, they love new things, so just coming out and seeing a new thing is exciting. Uh, and you feel, feel good doing it. Exercise, feel good, sunlight, sights, uh, and learning. There you go, five things. Wow, I didn't realize it was five. You get to learn at the same time. So you can be walking around or running around 
listening to an audio book at the same time. So if this was helpful for you, go ahead and leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to my button, you get more videos. Subscribe to my channel, I should say, you're gonna get more videos just like this. Lots of free little tips and hacks. Follow me on, on uh, Snapchat, and I'll catch you on the next one. From London, England. I'm gonna pick it up again. See ya. Hey, I'm James Swanick. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to watch my next video, then click here. If you want to subscribe to this channel to get new videos, click here. And if you want to follow me on social media, like my Snapchat right here, you can see my Snap. Click on the links down there. Go on, do it now. I'll wait for you. Snapchat, Snapchat me, Snapchat.